Yo guys, welcome back to another wonderful day in Pewter City. Um, I just have received news that a new person has moved into town. In the last episode, we saw a little plot of land being set aside for someone named Barbara. And if you look on the map here, um, that little flashing house, that is where she's at right now. And we're going to be going to see her today. Um, but first, we got a few things we got to do. Today's episode is going to be a really big one. In today's video, we're going to be doing so much stuff. Okay, wait, there's a dragonfly, bro. I ain't got a dragonfly yet. I ain't got it. Come on, give me, there we go. There we go. Yes. Oh, I think we do have this dragonfly. That's some extra money though. All right, so today's video is gonna be extra big because we're gonna be doing some kind of like crazy stuff. We're gonna be digging up all the little areas where we can dig to see if we can get some cool fossils or anything else. And we're also going to be trying to fish and uh, catch some stuff. And we're going to for sure pay our loan off today, uh, which is only 10,000 bells and we're currently at 4,000. So just 6,000 away. It isn't gonna be that hard. Um, but before we do anything at all, we do have some mail to check in on. Let's see what we got here. And we've got one letter here with a with a present on it. Um, let's check these things out here really quick. It's from our dad. All right, let's go ahead and check it out. How you doing? Made enough friends? Eating enough? Your mom is always worrying about you, dad. Thank you, dad. All right. It was Father's Day yesterday. Not yesterday, but yeah, yesterday. Yeah, yesterday was Father's Day, so hopefully you guys did some of for your father. And he sent us a red carnation, and we can we can plant it or we can wear it. It goes in our head. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna wear that. All right, so let's toss that. We'll keep this plant, uh, Dad, uh, for sure. But let's just make sure that we plant it somewhere. Let's remove that headgear. All right, let's plant it next to our house over here, next to this rock. Right here is going to be my, my little garden area. I'm gonna go ahead and plant this. And there you go, Dad gave us a sick rose. All right, um, so let's just go ahead and meet Barbara. Um, and see what she has to say for us today. I don't know what kind of stuff she has up her sleeve or what kind of house she's gonna have, but we're gonna meet her and see what she's all about. She lives just north uh, of our house, right across the river. Hopefully we're gonna be going uh, and building a bridge there one day. Hey, and here is, oh, is it Fluffy? Yes, it's Flurry, Flurry. I keep getting the names mixed up. I didn't know all the names because I'm the mayor. Good morning, Cole. So how can I help you? Uh, what's up? By the way, have you picked up any tools yet? I'm talking about the nets, fishing rods, and shovels. You can use a net to catch bugs and reel in fish with a fishing rod. Yeah, we've actually already got all three of those, so... Um, yeah. Thanks for the info. We've already got all three of those. Um, I think that's gonna be all... The We need a slingshot, though. I've seen so many balloons. Sometimes, if you look up in the sky here, you'll see little balloons flying by, and they have some pretty sick stuff in them. Alright, so we're almost to Barbara's house now. Just go past the town hall tree over here right next to the pond here and there's that and this should be Barbara's house right Barbara's house sweet there we go let's go ahead and go on inside now and who is gonna be inside here is it the same one from oh it's the same person I had this person on Animal Crossing for the GameCube all right here we go Oh, this is pressure. It's just too much. This whole day is unpacking and more unpacking. Excuse me, who are you? I I'm sorry, I didn't mean to be rude. And I really wanted to make a great first impression. I'm um, Babara. Wait, you, you must be cool. Everyone has told me about you. I promise tomorrow I'll be as sweet as a creme brulee. Please come visit tomorrow, okay? All right. Looks like she's just packing and stuff. We'll come back tomorrow and see how she's doing. So the next episode, we'll have some more stuff on her. Let's go on over and... Uh, Meet the rest of the people and see how they're doing today. What are you guys doing today? Hello, hello. Pretty morning, right? Uh, so what's going on, Cheekers? Let's talk. Oh, that's right. Hey, hang on a second. Uh, wait. I just thought I'd do a little quick change here. What do you think of my new outfit? Uh, you know, I kind of like it, but I like the one better. I'm not going to say it's bad. I'm going to say that it's pretty good. We'll go ahead and put it up there. It's just pretty good? Well, that's good enough for me. I'll stick with this look. Hey, here's an idea. You should try a fashion makeover, too. Here's something else I bought recently. You can have it to try it on. Hey, free clothes. Our actual first change of clothes. And this is going to be our first time changing into anything. All right. Thanks for the... Thanks for the tutorial, Apple. <laughs> clothes with names that end in shirt or long sleeve and those end in T or short sleeve. All right. That's pretty cool. All right, let's see here. This one is a short sleeve tee, picnic tee. Let's go ahead and wear that. All right, looks good. We look pretty dandy now. 
look we're ready to earn some money and stuff um we can sell this shirt and this dragonfly but we're gonna be making some money boys let's make some cash today all right so first thing we're gonna be doing is paying off this loan so we can get ourselves a builder permit and start building stuff in the town i think i'm gonna go ahead and sell enough pairs to just uh pay off my entire loan so i'm gonna go around the entire town shake every single tree until i find a pair let's go ahead and get this going baby i'll see you guys once i have 10,000 bells okay i just donated the new stuff to the museum um and i just remembered that last episode um we noticed that there was a little shack like a store kind of thing i'm gonna compare the prices of these two things and see what the difference in price is gonna be um, because I want to see which place can actually make you more money. I don't know if they have the same sale price, if they have the lower one or higher one. Um, but let's see what happens. First things first, uh, we will check over here. Alright, Tommy, we want to sell some stuff. Let's see what you've got. Okay. Um, how much will you give us for all these bugs and all these fish? Because these are high quality bugs and fish, my dude. Um, let's see here. He can give us almost 2,000 bells. That's pretty good. That'll get us to 8,000 and uh, just 2,000 bells away from our, our price. Um, but let's go to the other store and see if they sell anything. Remember, guys, 1.8K. Um, I'll see you guys over at the next store, all right? Okay, so the store is actually just west of the train station whenever you first walk through. Um, I'm not really sure what they sell. I think they sell furniture, if I remember correctly. Yeah, furniture. All right, so there's actually someone here. Timmy, Miss Reese, ma'am, I have something I'd like to sell. Oh, hello, Timmy. What did you bring for me today? Uh, I have a tape deck I'd like you to look at. Okay, I can take it off your hands. Okay, whatever. Tape deck. Okay. All right. There. Maybe they take a cheaper price here. I don't know what they do, but we'll see here. All right. All right, uh, can you finish your text off? All right, Timmy, get out. Please come to my shop when you get a chance. Love to see you. Okay, Timmy, we understand. But let's see how much this shop will take. You just sold that tape deck. That's kind of weird. Okay. Ah, uh, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the recycle shop, retail. Oh my, would you, like, would you happen to be the new mayor? Yes, that, that is me, actually. I am the new mayor, but I didn't know about your town or your little place, so I'm checking it out. I'm so happy you decided to stop by our humble little shop in honor. Our shop buys items and furniture to resell, okay. Um, we also pay a premium for any high value items listed on the board in front of the shop. In addition to selling us outright, you can set your own price and put items on display for others to buy. So, Mayor, if you have something you no longer need, please feel free to sell it for a fair price. Whatever, okay. Let's see uh, what you've got here. How much will you take for all of our bugs and fish here? Confirm. Okay. Right away. Well, then I could probably part. Oh, this is the place to sell stuff, boys. 2,300 bells. Deal. That's a for sure deal. All right. We know where to sell stuff now. They've also got a, a selection of other things. And I think we can sell our own furniture here. Uh, yeah. So that's pretty awesome. Yeah, there's some, there's some furniture here. We should probably get this locker for our house to put stuff in because we need like a place to put our stuff. But we need money right now to pay for our house. We'll buy stuff later once we have enough money. But we know where to do, uh, where to sell stuff. And she also said that there are high price items on this board out here. Uh, oyster shells. Okay, so oyster shells will sell for a lot of money. Maybe we should go to the beach and look for a few. You can actually reach the beach from right here. So let's give the beach. We haven't even looked at the beach yet, so we don't even know what it looks like. We're looking for oyster shells. Let's just pick up every shell that we see. Um, maybe we'll get an oyster shell. I don't know. Um, but we will see. I'm going to also look for some sick fish. I haven't caught a single ocean fish yet. A cowrie shell. There's an ocean fish. Um, I'm going to save a, like an episode just for ocean fishing. So I think I'll hold off on that for now. Unless I see like a sick shark fin or something sticking out of the water. All right. Once we get all the shells, how much more can we hold? We can hold six more shells. Let's get six shells and sell them and see how much money you just make off shells. Because that's going to be crazy, dude, if we can just sell these shells every day. Okay. That should be a full inventory. Nope, one more shell. There we go. Perfect. A full beach with a full inventory of shells. All right. Let's see how much we can get for this stuff. All right, ma'am. Let's see how much you'll buy these shells for. 
I've got a few shells. It was some it was some pretty easy stuff to sell or pick up. Um, I don't think we got any oyster shells at all. There's one. We got one oyster shell. So not much you can do about it. I don't think we'll get much money for these shells. Because, like, how much could you even get? Okay, one of them is a premium item. Oh, dude. Shells are the way to make money right now. 11,000 bells. We're a 1,000 over. How much for this uh, cabinet here? Clothes closet. Asking pro... Okay, yeah, we'll take this. We'll take this. We'll take this. All right, next stop, Tom Nook. Dude, we've got all the money we need to pay off our rent. I'm I'm ready to be debt-free. Not rent. I'm ready to be debt-free for our house down payment. We need to get this thing built, dude. All right. Put this fishing rod up. We got to head on over to the Nook's realty service to see what he can... So we'll see what he can do. So that means tomorrow, probably, or the next day. I don't know how many days it takes to build a house, but um, in a few days, we will have a house for sure. All righty. Nook's homes. Nook's homes. All right. Let's get our house set up. We've got so much money now. Welcome, welcome. All right, Tom Nook. Yes, yes. How may I help you? Um, down payment time, baby. Down payment time. All right. There's your money. You brought me the money. Let's have a look. Hmm. Yes, yes, exactly. 10,000 bells. That does make me rather happy. Okay. Very good, very good. Money makes everything official. And work on your house can begin at once. You can also choose the color of the newly built home's roof. So what color will it be? Um, my favorite color is blue, so I'll pick blue. I'll go ahead and do that. Yes, yes. So tell you, oh yes, yes, of course. I must tell you about the home remodeling. Once your house is finished, I can help you update the exterior. The exterior of your home consists of one of the things is consists of the things on the outside, such as your roof, door, the fence. Every day I will display new samples here to look through, so you should come by when you're grown curious. Well, for the moment, you must be looking forward to tomorrow. Yes, thanks much. We did it, boys. We did it. We've uh, paid off our down payment thing, so we got a house now. Yeah, look at that. Woo, I paid the down payment. I'll be able to move into my new home tomorrow. Yes, so I'm assuming that our new house will be done tomorrow. All right, so we've got our first piece of furniture here. That's gonna be like a little storage unit. Now, as I was um, playing earlier, I was talking to some of the villagers and stuff and just chatting about, and I think what I'm gonna be doing today is writing each one of them a letter because I think it's important that we are nice to the townsfolk and we thank them all for accepting us and also write Babara a like welcome letter for coming into the town. Every time we get a new citizen or something like that, we should welcome them into the town and see what they're all about. Um, but before we do any of that, I think we're gonna go ahead and um, start digging. We haven't dug anything up yet, so this is going to be a little adventure, guys. Hopefully we can find some cool stuff. Let's go ahead and start our excavation. Look, a praying mantis. You must slowly sneak up on it before you can catch it. It will pounce at you if you're not careful. And we will get it now. There we go, boys. We got it. We got ourselves a mantis. You're all right. So what I've been doing has been I've been catching just fish and bugs. I did run out of uh, some pears to sell. Uh, I ended up making just two thousand more dollars a little bit more over two thousand dollars I'm hoping that I can get two inventories of fish and bugs and then hopefully we'll have enough to pay off that housing debt um, But once I get enough money, I will see you guys then. All right guys see this right here is exactly what I was talking about If we can get a slingshot then we can actually pop those balloons and get the free gift out of them And sometimes it's like a really cool gift. So hopefully we'll get a slingshot very soon all right, boys, we are on the hunt for um, these little dig site area things. Let's see if we can find them. I remember seeing a lot of them, and hopefully we can find them all, and hopefully none of them are pitfalls. I'll test them all first to see if they're pitfalls, if we can even find one. Now, we've also got this whole area up here to explore. I don't know what this is, and there's a camel lady over here. And what's up, camel lady? What's up? Oh, uh, you talk to me later? Yes, we will discuss many things. Yes, okay. Okay. I don't know what that means. Hey, there we go. Is that a pitfall? It is not a pitfall. Our first dig site, boys. What's it going to be? Hey, it's a fossil. Sweet. All right. We can take it to the museum and get it examined. All right. So there we go. Our first dig of the day. Um, there we go. There we go. There we go. So actually, there's a... Once a day, I think there's a secret rock that has bells in it. So we gotta hit, we gotta hit all the rocks to make sure. Um, Cause there's, oh, there's, there's some pears I missed. 
we'll actually plant those. We should actually just go ahead and plant those right now. So that'd, that'd probably be a good thing to do. Because one of our things as the town, um, the town mayor is to, well, to get approved anyways, is to sell, well, is to sell like the, not sell, but make the town look nice. You know, that's one of our duties as the mayor. All right, let's uh, bury this. Good chow. There we go. Tree number one planted. And we'll plant one right here. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. We'll plant one right there. Go ahead and bury that pear. There you go, buddy. Alright. And we'll plant one up in this little open space here. Because it's kind of barren, you know? We need a lot we need a lot more stuff. I wish we could find more fruit. Because we only have these pears. If we could get something else, that'd be nice. All right, let's go find some more dig spots. You gotta be, you gotta be looking everywhere, because they could literally be on any tile. Okay, here's another rock. Can we get the secret? Nope. You gotta be good at it though, because it's timed. The secret money rock somewhere, and here it is. This is the secret money rock, boys. Nope, not the secret money rock. But is there any star things nearby that we can dig up? I thought there was one next to the water over here. I remember seeing it. I remember seeing something somewhere close. All right. Do you guys see that there's another rock? Can test to see if it's the money rock. Once a day, you can find the money rock. Or maybe it's not even in this game. But there's some there's some Animal Crossing game where there's a money rock. There's another there's some more pairs I missed. And here's another fossil. Yes. Your fossil time, baby. Fossil time, baby. Fossil time, baby. There's another bee. Some bees, baby. There's some bees. And nothing over this way. Nothing over this way. I could have swore there were more fossils than this. There's a rock right there. Sorry, look at this rock. Now, this is a brand new rock. And this one could potentially be the money rock. Nope. That's gonna suck if that's ever the money rock. I need to move that tree or cut it down one day if I can. All right, here we go, ka Oh, a pitfall, dude. All right, we're gonna get rid of that. We don't need those in the town. That's just kind of annoying to have those around. Cause like, what if one of our villagers fell into that? If our villagers fell into that, that'd be all oh, some weeds back here. We have the, oh, I accidentally picked up those cosmos or whatever they are. Just gonna go ahead and replant those really quick. Plant those back, ka -chow. There you go. All right. Oh, there's a rock here and that thing. Oh, this is the money rock, boys. This is the money rock. And come on, there's nowhere for the money to go. Come on, give us the money. Give us the money. Give us the money. Okay, well, how much money did we get from this money rock? Once a day, we can do this. There's all kinds of secrets in this game that you just gotta know. You just gotta know the secrets, boys. All right, whoops. I dug too far away from the, from the star. All right. Let's see here, and catch up. Another fossil, sweet. All right, how much money do you get? Well, you can get another money from the money rock, but there was a fossil in there. I should have dug that up first. I was not very smart. So wait, is this 4,000? Bruh, no way. Wow, we didn't even have to fish or anything. We could have just hit the money rock one time and we would have had enough money to pay off Tom Nook. All right, so we know how to get some money every day, at least 10,000 bells. So there's that. And there's also a few other secrets. Um, one tree in this town contains a secret piece of furniture every single day. And it's really risky though because you could get bees and stuff. Bees will attack you. Alright, so that's every dig spot on this side of the river I think. There's one more dig spot on over. Maybe a few more dig spots. I don't remember. Really remember. Dude, that is a big fish. That is a big fish. All right, I, I can't pass up on this. That's a big fish right there. Come on, what are we gonna get from this? I'm about to sneeze, I gotta hold it in. Oh no, no, I reeled it in. I get so nervous when it comes to fishing and stuff, my dudes. I can't believe I messed that up. Dang it. Well, you win some and you lose some, right boys? All right. We'll get it one day. We'll get that fish one day. There's another gift up there in the sky. If we had our slingshot, we could get that easy. But we don't have a slingshot, boys. We, we need one so bad. Do, do, do. Hmm. 
Another oh, praying mantis over there, and there's some more pears. I guess I didn't look hard enough that when I was selling those pears. Uh, hey, we haven't talked to you today. Oh, sorry. Oh, I can't believe I sneezed. Sorry. Yo, Cole. Seeing your face. Well, let's just say I'm ready to start a new day. So what's up? Let's talk, my dude. Oops, man. That's right. I haven't checked the bulletin board today. Have you hit the bulletin board in front of the station like at all? I actually did check it yesterday, so there we go. I'll go check it later. You don't tell me what it says. This is just between us. I found a secret. I found an amazing secret having to do with the bulletin board. Have you noticed? Not, okay, yes, the bird thing. I knew it. The bird on the top lets you know there's a new message. That's perfect. That's weird how that bird does that, though, don't you think? That is really weird. That's a weird bird. All right. Let's, we found the money rock for today, so we're all good on money rocks. And yeah, it looks like I didn't even get any pears on this side of the river. Must have been lazy earlier. But now we know that the real way to earn money is... Uh, where are all the dick? Oh, dude, is that a cricket or something? What is that? Give me that. I need this bug. Where'd it go? There he is. We're gonna get this bug. Dang it. Did he get away? He got away, boys. Well, I think that's all the dig spots. Um, if I see any more, I guess I'll dig them up. But let's go ahead. How much space do we have in our inventory? We have quite a bit of space. We found three of these fossils. And there we got that. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We got nine spaces here. Um, we could go ahead and check out the beach down here we haven't actually checked the beach out down here so we could actually load up on some fossils oyster shell not fossils but shells if we can get oyster shells we can sell them uh for quite a bit of money actually okay i'll come back for you guys if i have more space but we'll see oyster shell cowrie shell whatever that is all right what's next cowrie shell and venus comb shell those venus i think the venus comb ones sell for a lot that's the one that sell for the most. Oyster shell, there we go. And sand dollar and okay, we can we can just go ahead and pick up uh five more stuff. Okay, so one and uh two and three. What's over here next? Four. We can get one more. And then we can head on out. Perfect. There we go. So we dug up all the spots and we got all these shells. I'm gonna go sell these to the to the lady and see what we can do with them. Hey, 2,000 more bells, there we go. All right, so we're back up to 10,000 bells again. We got quite a bit of stuff racking up right now. Um, let's uh, let's do a few more things today, like I said. We've got, we got those three fossils too, so let's take them over to Blather and see what he has to say about these fossils. All right, let's see what he can do with these fossils. All right, Blather, here is the first fossil. Tell me about it. Let me just see here. Hum. Well, hello. Oh, Eureka. The most certainly is... It's, a, it's just a... Oh, gosh. I just burped a little bit. Okay. There you go. There's a free amber, dude. Blathers. Um, we have two more fossils for you to check out. I actually think fossils are really cool, and I wouldn't mind putting any in my house if I could get some, like, extra... If I get, like, a full dinosaur, I need, like, a full dinosaur for my house for sure. Uh, let me just see here. Hmm. A saber-toothed skull. Uh, we don't have this fossil in our collection yet, would you? Okay, I'll take it. You guys can have it. Um, anything that you guys don't have, you can go ahead and... I'll donate it here. Uh, we got one more fossil for you to look at. Um, let's see here. There you go. Fossil, there you go. And what's it going to be? It's going to be... Oh! After some consideration, I declare this to be a dinosaur egg. We don't have this fossil yet in our... Okay, you can have it. You can have it. All right, let's go ahead and let's check out the exhibits. Um, it's been a while. We The first episode we went through and looked at the fish one, but since then we've actually added bugs, and now we've added three dinosaur fossils, so uh, we can go check those fossils out really quick and just what they look like. Just to see what... Just to get an idea of what uh, the future of this museum is going to be, baby. All right, so... Do we have anything in the first room? Nothing at all in the first room, seems like. Alright, well, first room is empty. Yep, so let's go on over to this room. Maybe there's some dinosaurs over here. Somewhere is an amber and an egg fossil. 
And I don't think they're going to be in this room either. Let's go on down. Let's go on down to the next dinosaur room. Museum. This is kind of a weird museum, to be honest. Okay, there we go. The amber and the egg fossil. Sweet. Those look pretty cool. We have a saber tooth skull somewhere, too. Hey, and it's actually in the same room. So, that only has two pieces to it. Awesome. So, we have... We give them two of these little ones, like this little stand here, and we got the saber tooth skull. So, there's the three fossils that we've donated to the to the museum since we've played in these past three days. Um, let's go on over then. Let's make sure we got enough bugs. The museum is coming along nicely. I do think so. Um, I will be looking for paintings. I don't really know how to get them. I actually completely forgot how to get paintings, so I don't, don't know where I'll be getting those from. Um, let's see here. Bugs. We do have some bugs. See a shadow over there. Okay. There's a darner dragonfly. We got the tiger dragon, the tiger butterfly, the yellow one, and the common one. And that's some cool butterflies. And over here we have that sick bee we caught. And I don't think we have many beetles or any kind of bugs that go on trees that much. I think we only caught like one of those. But we can go check this place out over here. And we have a praying mantis in here. That's pretty sick. And there's a bug. That's pretty awesome. And here we have Snake Dude. What's up? Yo, Cole. You into bugs too? What you need? Just want to chat, my dude. Before you challenge your enemy, you gotta know who you're facing. If you want to catch bugs, make sure you observe them first. Okay. So he must be like a bug expert, dude. He's in here just letting these bugs and chilling out. We've got one more bug room over here to this side. We'll check it and see how it looks. So far, the dinosaur room is the most boring. Um, I'm assuming that the... Uh, Okay, this is like tropical bugs. We need to plant palm trees. We need some palm trees for sure. So, tropical bugs. Um, we need to plant um, palm trees to get tropical bugs, I think. And I think they just randomly wash up on your shore. So, like, every other day you should go check out your shore. And see if you can find any palms. Uh, palm, palm, coconuts or whatever. And I think coconuts sell for a good amount of money, too. So... If I ever do find palm tree, like a coconut, I'm going to be planting those everywhere, dude. Everywhere. Alright, let's check out our fish, and then we'll be done with the museum for today. And I don't think I'm going to fish, or if I, if I do catch a bug, it'll be because it's a cool bug and I haven't seen it yet. I try to get all the bugs I haven't seen. I think this is an ocean area here, so we haven't caught any ocean fish yet. So we'll just check out this one room over here that has like the river stuff in it. It's probably starting to come along pretty nice, actually. It should be getting pretty full. Yeah, so, look at this. There's only two fish in here, but look at this tank. This tank is starting to look good, dude. That one fish is, like, up at the top there, and then this other one's at its mouth at the top. There's a frog up there. That's the frog we caught earlier. And over here, we got the black bass, a piranha. I actually caught a piranha. I forgot to show you guys, but it follows you. Look at that. It's trying to get me. It's trying to eat me. I don't think in real life piranhas are actually as aggressive as they make them out to be in like the movies and stuff. So that's just kind of made up. But this is all the fish that we've captured so far, all the different kinds anyways. We still got a whole lot of fish to catch. Um, and we haven't even been to the ocean yet. So there's a lot, a lot, a lot of fish. Um, so what are we going to do now? I think I'm going to start writing the letters uh, for people. But I think we should give them gifts and stuff, you know? We should definitely give them, well, we should for sure give a gift to uh, Babara or whatever. Um, she is um, new to the town, so of course she needs something new for herself. Maybe we could give some gifts and stuff. We have some shirts we can probably, probably buy for our people. Uh, what else? We have some headgear and stuff, but I don't know if the animals actually can wear that stuff. I think that's just for the players. But let's see what they have for sale. Hello and welcome to the Handmade Fashion Palace, the Able Sisters. Alright, so we have a few things here. Um, This shirt, this dress. Alright, the caveman tank dress. Yeah, we'll, we, we can... Alright, we'll buy it. We we'll might as well buy it. We'll buy a few presents. We have five people in our town or whatever. Genie shirt. Alright, somebody can be a genie. We'll buy this. Alright. And that's two presents. I don't know. We'll, maybe we'll give it another present away. Something. I don't know. I had that extra shirt. What I, do, I sold that, didn't I? Yeah, I sold that. So, we're going to have to find something. Maybe people like pears. <laughs> do they like pears? Um, Alright. Let's go. I think if you give presents when you mail stuff to people, they actually send back letters. And they give you presents back. Which is cool. Alright. Um, let's buy some presents here. 
We have this bear. We actually need some more paper. I think it only comes in fours, so we've got that one stack of paper. Lined paper. All right. Yeah, so it comes in sets of four. We'll take this. We have another paper at the house. All right. How much for the satellite? 2,600 bells. Might as well give it to us. Yeah, I think it's important we buy stuff from the store, too, so they'll upgrade their uh, upgrade their store. I like this bear, though. I think I'm gonna give that to Barbara. You know, she's new. She looks like she kind of liked that kind of stuff, so I'll get her that. I'll get her that. Thanks for the thanks for the help, Tommy. Thanks for the help. All right, let's get to writing these letters. But first, actually, we need to actually buy another gift. We've only got we've only got five. We've had five people in town. Let me check the map really quick. Ooh, my back is kind of killing me. Let's see who all we've got in town here. We've got we got one, two, three, four. But we have six people in town. Yeah, we have six townspeople. So I need six presents. Um, I ain't gonna do this every day. This is just like me being the mayor, me being nice and stuff, trying to get my approval rating raised up a little bit. I think I got my other paper in this locker. I think I put everything in here. Yeah, so we got some storage in here. There we go, there's some more paper. Um, I need some more presents, baby. I need some presents. All right, let's go. Let's go. We can buy presents over here, actually. Oh, no. What time is it? 12 p.m. All right. Let's go. We can, we can buy some stuff over here. We can buy some stuff. They have... I think they had a bed. And this sick-looking fern. Actually, is that an aloe plant? I might get that aloe plant for myself. Uh, Yeah, I'll take the aloe. I'm going to take that for my own house, actually. So tomorrow when we move in, we'll have a sick aloe plant. And 500 bells for that. Might as well. And you never know when you need a bed. Might as well go ahead and just buy the bed. All right, we'll take that bed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Sweet. So we're giving everybody business today. Let's go and let's go back to our house and write the letters there. I'm just going to make them very simple and sweet. I'm not going to show you guys. I'll show you guys each and every one of them. So you can like pause them and read them if you want to. Um, but I'm just going to write them myself then to show you guys later. I might read one of them. I don't know. But I'll see you guys in my house. I thought I saw a big old butterfly. There we go. Is this called the bird ring butterfly? Ah, uh, Raja, bro. I think these are expensive. I think you can sell these for a lot of money, like a thousand bells each. If I see another one of those, I'll be selling that for sure. But that one's going to the museum. That was some rare butterflies, dude. That's some rare stuff there. I ran. I went all, I was all the way over here and I ran. Okay. <clears throat> I ran, yeah, just to do that. Um, but there we got it. And, oh. Never mind, there's a new bug again. We have so many bugs to get. Is this a white mantis? An orchid mantis. That's pretty sweet. It looks way cooler. I like that one a lot. That one's pretty sick, yo. Alright. Where's our little tent at? We need to find our tent. Our tent, where is it? Alright. Um, we now have that, uh, that cabinet or whatever. You can store stuff in that. I'm gonna go ahead and put that down. Yeah, we have such such a sick looking house, right? All right, let's go ahead and display this clo clothes closet. Hopefully you can just put more than just clothes in it. We're gonna go ahead and put it up against the wall here though. Let's open it up. Can Yeah, you can, it's connected. So you have all this space. You have three different things and you have six for each one. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and write these letters and I will see you guys once I have finished writing each letter. There we go, guys. I have completed every single letter. Um, so pretty much they all say the same things. I'll just show you what they say, kind of. It's like, thanks for the warm uh, thanks for the warm welcome. I hope to make this town very fun place to live, whatever. It's kind of like just different variations of the same thing. Um, except for Snake. Snake got, uh, Snake got the coolest letter. I give him uh, this one here. It says, hey, dear Snake. Hey, I think you're the coolest villager in the whole town. Hopefully he's gonna like that one. I'll give him that six satellite. And also, uh, Babara, she's the newest person, so I did make her letter a little bit different. It says, welcome to the town. Here is a housewarming gift. I hope you like it. And we're gonna give her the bear, so. Um, this one is the satellite. We'll give the satellite to a snake there. And the bear can go to Babara. And, uh, what is this? This is the aloe. I'm keeping the aloe. Uh, the bed, I might keep the bed. The common chair, uh, we can can give that to... We'll just give the other gifts out randomly. 
Uh, here's that. There's that. And I still need one more gift. What is this? The bed or the aloe? I like the aloe better than I like the bed. So I'll get rid of the bed. There we go. We have all of our letters written and we have presents for each and every single villager in the town. Now I wanna see tomorrow uh, if they're gonna send us stuff back. That's how it works, I think. So I'll meet you guys. Oh, after after I dig though, just say pitfall or what? Nope, this is gonna be something nice. Hey, it's a fossil. All right, um, let's go mail these and then check out this last fossil, all right? All right, the post office is just right here. Elmer, don't look, I'm mailing you a letter. You don't need to be in here. We've actually never been to the post office before, so this is, I think, I don't think we've been to the post office before. Is this the first time we've been here? Let's just go ahead and sell some stuff. All right, welcome to the pewter post office. What can I help you with today? Uh, let's go ahead and send some mail. Okay, sure thing. What would you like to send your mail to? Uh, let's send it to a person in pewter. Yeah, we want to send it to everything, okay. Okay, we can send all these at once. Perfect. All right, there we go. Six letters. You can actually send letters to your future self, which is kind of weird. That's kind of weird. All right, I'll send these mail off at once. Thanks for choosing Peter Post Office. It's kind of the only place to do it. There's, a, there's more plants there. And is this an ATM machine? What is this thing? Welcome. Please select from the following options. Okay, so it's just an ATM machine. All right. We'll keep all our money on us right now because we don't really have that much money to deposit. We got like 4,000 left, I think. All right. Um, so we've completed our loan today. We've mailed everybody a letter. We still have one fossil to check out. And look at all this. This place looks kind of awful. Yeah, it looks kind of bad. We got to fix this town up ASAP, my dudes. We got so many places that could potentially be like really nice areas. Um, let's go to the town. Let's go over to the town, the museum area. So how long is our term as mayor in this game? Do you just like mayor permanently or something like that? All right, Blathers, what have you got for us? What have you got for us, my dude? Whew. Oh, okay, okay, here we go. We got some fossils for you to shake out, Blathers. All right, let's see, we got one fossil. Hopefully this is something cool. Come on, T-Rex, T-Rex something. Let me see, oh, it's a, it, Ichthyo skull. What an Ichthyo is. Alright. You can have it. You can have it. Okay. There you go. There's another skull for your dinosaurs. Sweet. Nah. We're all good there. We're all good. Then please enjoy the rest of your visit. Okay. I'm glad that the museum is coming along quite nicely, you know. I like the old... Like on... I think it was... I forget if it was City Folk or if it was the, the other DS one. I forget what the other DS one's called. Um... But you can make constellations like the stars and stuff. Oh, that was cool. All right. So I think we're done in the top of the town for today on Main Street. Let's go back to Isabel and see what our town rating is to see if it's like gone up any at all. We paid off our debt and stuff, so I don't know if that changes anything. But we can actually see if we want to. Okay. 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 What are we doing here? What are we doing here? All right. There we go. There we go. Isabel, I have some stuff. As mayor, come back here and talk to me. So, if mayorly duties, she comes back to my desk and talks to me. Anything else, she doesn't do that. Hey, mayor, is there something I can help you with? Um, so let's check out the developer permit and stuff. Good to know how much progress you've made toward getting the permit. Well, your house isn't ready yet, but you've paid your down payment, so that's good. However, in order to receive your development permit, you need an approval a rating of 100%. According to a recent survey of the townsfolk, your mayoral approval rating is 41%. Okay. Pulling up any weeds around town. Yeah, no one likes weeds. Alright, so yeah, I've already pulled up weeds and stuff. Okay, so I think just doing anything in town better is just like a, just good. So, we just need 100% to be a town to be like a mayor or something. I don't know. Alright, so we've done that. We've picked up all the weeds and stuff. We've done that. Maybe we should plant a few more trees. All right, so how much space we got in our inventory? Uh, we actually could have donated these bugs to the museum while we were there. Uh -huh. And we've also got this aloe we have here. Let's just get a few pears and see if we can... Um, yeah, we can we can knock down three. We can plant nine trees, of course. All right, let's plant nine trees. And that should improve the... That's a pretty big fish, but I'm passing that one. Um, it should improve our rating overall. Alright. 
Where is everything? Where is all this stuff? I need a fishing, not a fishing, but I need a like watering can. Like half the flowers in the town are dead, and except for over here, there's some nice flowers over here. And what's up, my dude? You want to do like a fishing contest? I can't wait for the. Yeah, what's up with him? What's new, my dude? I, w I can't wait for the villagers to be like. Okay. Okay. Hold down, so you can take pictures. Okay. All right. So there, I took a picture. I guess. Anything? All right. So I guess nothing else. He's teaching us stuff. All right. So there's still, there's still talk telling us tutorial stuff. I guess until we have our first house and like get an understanding of the game. They're gonna keep saying stuff like that. But it's way more fun whenever they're actually like living and then telling us and then like we do stuff for them. I remember on like the Animal Crossing GameCube game, like you're always doing chores for people, like going in and getting stuff, and that's how like you became friends and things. Um, but it's different; it's way better on this game. All right, one more tree, and then we'll start planting stuff. I think on this side of the river, there's quite a bit of plants, and I don't know. I don't know about that. What's that? What was that bug? Okay, it's just a butterfly. Thought it was like something cool for a minute. I mean, not, not that butterflies aren't cool, but. It's just that I'm looking for super sick bugs. All right, I think that's everything, right? Any more pears? All right. All righty. We got six pears at least. So let's go ahead and plant these bad boys so we can have a better look in town. All right, that should be the last tree. I planted four of them right here just to... This is a really open area, and I like it to look very nice from my little work area here. Alright, so, I think that's gonna be it for that. Uh, let's go see if we can find any other stuff to do for today's town. There's a bee there, can it sting us? Okay guys, so, we've done all kinds of stuff today. Today we have paid off our loan, we've figured out a lot of ways to make money, we figured out that that shop sells for a lot more stuff. You can get like 10,000 coins or bells a day from the, the secret rock and stuff. And we've also donated some fossils and stuff and a lot of fish and bugs today. We've done so much today, more than any episode yet. This is just episode three that we have so much stuff left to do. And in tomorrow's episode, we're going to have our house. So there's going to be a lot of things to look forward to in the next episode. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this. If you guys are, you can leave a like or subscribe to the to the channel. I think like 90% of my viewers are not even subscribed to my channel, which which is pretty crazy. But if you guys are interested in video, videos like this or other videos about me, you guys can click um, right here. And yeah, I did it right that time. You guys can click one of those videos if you want to. And I will see you all in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm really enjoying playing this game. Thank you so much.